One starlit evening, two kids were looking through their telescope, observing and learning about the planets. They're trying so hard to learn about the planets, Luna said thoughtfully. Luna visited her friends, the owl, the rabbit, and the fox. How can I help them? She said. Luna's eyes sparkled with excitement. I have an idea, she beamed. Let's take them on a space adventure to meet all my planet friends. With a sprinkle of moonlight magic, Luna and the two children soared into the sky, sitting on the crescent moon as they began their journey through the solar system. First, they visited tiny Mercury, spinning closest to the sun. It's very warm here, said Luna, as they felt the heat surrounding the little planet. Next came beautiful Venus, wrapped in swirling clouds that sparkled like pearls. She's Earth's sister, Luna explained with a smile. As they passed by Earth, their beautiful blue and green home, Luna marveled at its swirling white clouds that looked as soft as cotton candy. Hello down there, she called out cheerfully, waving with excitement. After leaving Earth, they journeyed to Mars, the next planet in line. I am the red planet, Mars declared proudly. Earth's cousin, Luna added with a smile. Scientists from Earth have even sent two robots to explore Mars. Maybe we can spot them from here. Then came mighty Jupiter, the biggest of them all. Look at that giant storm spot, Luna pointed. It's been swirling for hundreds of years. Saturn twirled gracefully, showing off her beautiful rings. They're made of ice and rocks, Luna said, giving them a little shimmer. Uranus rolled by like a blue marble. Did you know Uranus spins sideways? Luna giggled. It makes this planet unique. Finally, they met Neptune, the windiest planet of all. Neptune may be far, Luna smiled, but it's never lonely with all these stars around. Luna noticed something interesting. Each planet is different, but they're all part of the same family, the solar system. The children nodded excitedly. Just like how we're all different, but we're all friends. Luna smiled, and they all worked together, spinning in their special dance around the sun. As they returned home, Luna smiled and saw more children watching through their telescopes. Now you know a little more about my planet friends, each planet has its own special story to tell. Luna said, just like each of you has something special too. That night, the children went to bed dreaming of colorful planets, cosmic dances, and the magic of space. Join Luna next time for another magical adventure. And don't forget to subscribe to learn more wonderful things 